Bears fans, I am backstage with the big winner tonight. He is undefeated in the squared circle. No one beats us to the punch. KFC. How are you feeling? Oh man, it feels great to be here. I want to thank everybody for coming through, coming and support me and Bare Knuckle. We have a good production here. All the guys are good. I came to see and feel what these guys go through. You know, I'm, I'm in the corner all my, always fixing them up. So now I want to feel how, how it is to be inside the ring. And I came out and did my thing and thank God for everybody. Everybody, thank you for coming. Sure did do your thing. Four knockdowns, three rights, and one left, wasn't it? Yes, correct. First one was a left, and the rest was a right. Did you prepare specifically for your bare knuckle debut any differently than you have? Because you have a boxing background. I mean, yes, I have a boxing background. Um, they changed my opponent three times. He came in at the last minute. I said, you know what? Bring it on. I mean, I, I was practicing for it. I'm ready for it. So come on, let's go. Let's do it. And let's talk about your background, because I knew you was G the Cut Man, and everybody else knows you was G the Cut Man, but you gotta tell our fans here a little bit about your background. So my background, um, I come from a small little town, uh, Pahokee, Florida, up in uh, Lake Okeechobee. You know, I was raised there when I, when I came from Cuba when I was five years old. And uh, I started boxing when I was seven years old. And uh, I met Nelson Lopez, and from there on, I've been, I've been boxing ever since. I got 35 amateur fights one pro boxing fight, and now I have a BKFC fight. What does it feel like to fight without gloves? Oh, uh, you know what? It does feel a little different, but this is my game. I love this <laughs> I love it. Any thoughts on who you might want to fight next? I really don't care who it is. Just put them on the roster and we'll fight them. You got to admit, you, you could hear those fans screaming for you tonight. Could you hear them in the crowd? Uh, to tell you the truth, I didn't hear nothing. I was tunnel vision. My eyes were locked in. And even my coach like, you didn't hear me? I said, no, man, I'm sorry. I, I, I did start it off a little while, then I'm sorry. That's not me. But I just felt like I heard them, so I needed to take them out. Before we go tonight, any friends, family, or sponsors you'd like to thank? Chief? Yes, I want to thank all my sponsors. Um, I got them all in my shorts, there's too many. I got, I got GFT, Global Fight Token. I got Raynello Management. I got Dynamic Wellness. I got Bare Knuckle, Sign Shot, The Fighting News. Lions Not Sheep. We got Nerds, uh, Nerd Focus. I got a couple more in my back. There's too many. I want to thank all my sponsors. I want to thank David Feldman for giving me this opportunity to shine. I want to thank Nelson Lopez for dealing with all my bull I'm sorry and I love you. And we love you too, G. This for Bare Knuckle News, I'm Susan Sigari. This is G the Cup, man. And nobody beats us to the nobody punch. Nobody beats us to the punch.